The Man Who Rode a Tornado Matt Suter is a 19-year-old school student from southwest Missouri in the USA. He was visiting his grandmother in her trailer when something terrible happened. A powerful tornado ripped his grandmother's home apart. They had ignored tornado warnings and were chatting inside the trailer. Suddenly, they heard a roaring sound moving through the nearby trees. It got louder and louder. It was like 10 airplanes around us, Suta said. The next thing he knew, the walls, floors and ceiling were moving and the floor started shaking like jelly. The front and back doors suddenly blew away. Furniture was moving around in all directions. A heavy lamp swung into Suta's head and cut him. The tornado picked Suta up and carried him out of the trailer. It finally dropped him in a soft, grassy field. An official from the National Weather Service actually measured how far Suta had traveled. It was a record-breaking 400 meters. Suta woke up in the grassy field and realized what had happened. He didn't know if his grandmother was alive. Lightning lit up the countryside. He ran towards his neighbor's house. Amazingly, apart from a cut on his head and a few small cuts and bruises on his body, Matt was okay. His neighbor wrapped him in a blanket and drove him back to the trailer. His grandma had survived the tornado, but the trailer was in pieces. But she was just delighted to see Matt again. She hadn't expected him to survive. Matt was lucky to escape with his life. No other person has traveled that far and lived to tell the tale. He said of his frightening experience, I had always wanted to see a tornado, but I definitely didn't want to be in one. 